I love these resting squats or primal squats or Asian squats, whatever you choose to call them. They just feel great to me. They really loosen up my lower back. Stick around and see how these have influenced my barbell squat lately. Hey gang, welcome back to Mark's 60 Plus Fitness Journey. Today is Wednesday, May 4th, 2022, and it is a leg day. Now today is a pretty special leg day for me. Today I implemented a new squat, and um, I'm, really, I'm really digging it. I'm jazzed about this. Uh, I've been doing a primal squat, resting squat, uh, Asian squat, whatever you want to call that, as a pre, as a warm-up to my stretching routine. And it always made my lower back feel really good. And I've been thinking about doing full bottom out ATG squats, ass to grass squats uh, for a while. So today I decided to put my ego aside because I knew I was, wasn't going to be able to do these with any kind of weight at all. So I put my ego aside, started doing them today, got a baseline. They felt great. So let me show you what I did there in regards to the ATG squats and plus one other thing I've been meaning to implement, which I did today. So let's get at it. Alrighty, let's get this leg day underway. Now, as I said, today I implemented ATG squats, ass to grass squats. And I've been meaning to do this for a while. Every time I do my primal squats as a warm up for my stretching, I think about this. And I've been hesitant to do it because I knew I was going to have to start over from scratch and um, create a new baseline. So that's what I decided to do today. And here I did a couple of sets just with the barbell just to get a, a feel for the depth and how I, how I was going to feel coming out of the hole there. And I moved up to 135 for one set of five. Again, just trying to... I guess it was more of a finder set to see what kind of weight I wanted to start with to set my baseline. So I decided on 185 here. It's going to be my new baseline to start with. And uh, I'm going to do these just like my the way I was doing squats. I'm going to do three by fives, three sets of five reps. And as you know, as soon as I can do three sets of five reps at a given weight, I'll move up. I may even do five by fives. We'll see how it goes. But the more I got into these, the better this felt. And you'll notice also, this is something else I've been meaning to do and I did today. I'm doing these squats facing away from the mirror. I just feel like um, relying on the mirror to kind of uh, validate the form or help me with my my squatting form or technique is, is not helpful. So I'm going to start facing away from the mirror. This is my last set here. And I think this was my best one. It felt really good. You see the depth is good. I was whole, it fe I felt strong. This 185 felt really good. So I'll easily be able to go up 10 pounds my next session. I actually did um, eight sets of five here. So feeling pretty strong. And, um, that bottom just felt really good. So I'm happy I did this today. And I'm looking forward to uh, some really strong progress here. Yep, glad I did that. Now here is another movement I've been meaning to try out for a while. I just haven't done it. And to be honest with you, it's because I really didn't know how to use this thing. So this is a belt squat, and uh, today I just decided I'm going to go over there and figure this thing out, and uh, to be honest, it took a few minutes to get it set, and I'm still not sure. I think I need to uh, work on the chain uh, hookup there to the machine, but these things felt good. I did three sets of 12 reps on here, and uh, this is the last set here, and um this is uh, almost like a constant tension, constant time under tension kind of movement. You really don't get a lot of break on this. So uh, again, I, I was pleasantly surprised with this. Um, felt good. Three sets of 12. And this last one, <laughs> last one was a bear. 
Again, I'm glad I threw those in today. And then I finished up the rest of leg, the, my leg day with uh, the usual suspects, at least in regards to my leg workouts. Did some single leg presses, three sets. Well, actually, I did two sets of 12 reps with my right leg and three sets of 12 reps with my left. Still working on trying to uh, get my left leg up to the size of my right. Try to create a little more symmetry there. And then I did some hamstring work. I did uh, three sets of these laying, lying um, leg curls. And uh, here, I actually remembered my tempo. I, I did a video on my chain modified tempo of it was a two four like two seconds up and hold then four seconds down and on these uh, these leg curls here it was more like um, I guess three seconds up and hold and then maybe six seconds down but twice as long down as up and and concentrating on uh, contracting at the once you fully shorten the muscle so three sets of 12 reps of leg curls and then i did some uh, calf work um did some high rep calf work here did uh, two sets of i think 25 and um here's another example of asymmetry and mr mark here my left calf is uh significantly smaller than my right actually so whenever I do these I try to focus on that right, that left side but two sets of high rep calf calf work then I finished up today with some leg extensions and here again I focused on the uh, tempo um, it's more like a three second up Let's hold the contraction maybe six seconds down but slow up, contract, hold it on the way down. And I did three sets of these as well. And uh, this was right around 10 reps. But uh, I tell you what, after seven reps, it was hard. But it was a nice way to finish up the leg day. And uh, got some walking to do later on and some food and some grocery shopping. But uh, I am glad you, hang you uh, took the time to hang out with me today. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. It was a good one. All right, so there it was. Today's leg day with ATG squats and belt squats. And some of my normal uh, go-to leg routines for leg day. That was a, it was a good leg day. And I'm glad I, st I started doing these ATG squats because I got to tell you, it feels good. My back feels feels excellent right now it's about a I don't know a couple hours after that workout um, man pretty jazzed about it looking forward to starting with that and moving upwards slowly incrementally safely ego free um, I'm gonna do three by fives there initially to see how it works and I'm not gonna I'm gonna move up at a comfortable leisurely uh, reasonable pace on this so anyway, uh, so there you go. Tomorrow's, uh, what is tomorrow? Tomorrow is uh, chest, no, tomorrow's shoulder day. Tomorrow's shoulder day. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to get uh, get that recorded. Um, but so there you go. That's it. Um, just want to say thank you for stopping in. Thank you so very much for visiting. I really do appreciate it. Um, more to follow. So stick around and stay tuned. And with that, I will say until next time. Go get them. Mark out.